Remember, you decide the fate of your characters. All of them can die. So, be careful. Mm-hmm. Y'all ain't ready for this. Let's go ahead with this android Negro spiritual. Sung by the great Luther. Accessing the extras section. Y'all know how I like to start my string. Whoops, wrong one. I like to start these off. Actually, it's my first time on YouTube. So I might do another one of the videos while I prepare. <clears throat> we'll see. I'm trying to pull this up on my tablet and everything. <laughs> Hold on, just a little while longer. Hold on, just a little while longer. Hold on, just a little while longer. What's up, Andrew Craig? Tyler White. Everything will be alright. Everything will be alright. Fight on just a little while longer. Fight on. Just a little while longer Fight on Just a little while longer Everything will be alright Everything will be alright We will sing on Get it, Luther. Bravo. Bravo. <clears throat> Bravo, Luther. Bravo. Alright. Take y'all through the... Actually, let's get this story started. Why does it say continue instead of new game? I want a new game. Hold on one second. Uh -oh. I got a full screen for this. And I dropped my remote. I just noticed that. Where did I drop it at? It's dark in here. My light don't work no more. Did you know the motto of Detroit is, we hope for better things? New story. See if Connor any good this time. <clears throat> What's up, Tamisha Mazik?
negotiator on site. You can't do cold. that. You why aren't you sending a real person? Don't let that thing here. Keep that thing away from my daughter. Keep it away from me. Please, two times sending an android. That piece of crap can jump on the rooftop any second. I don't give a shit. My men are ready to step in. Just skip the order. Captain Allen, my name is Connor. I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. It's firing everything that moves. It already shot down two of my men. We could easily get it, but they're on the edge of the balcony. If it falls, she falls. Do you know its name? I haven't got a clue. Does it matter? I need information to determine the best approach. <clears throat> Has it experienced an emotional shock recently? Listen, saving that kid is all that matters. So either you deal with this fucking android now, or I'll take care What's of it. What's up, Tasha?
waiting for. We should take down this asshole. Stay back! Don't come any closer or I'll jump! Headache, Tasha. Yes, sucks. My name is Connor. What about you? What is your name? Daniel. That's the name they gave me. Stay back. going to die. All humans die eventually. Dying. What does it matter if this one dies now? I'm going to apply a tourniquet. Don't touch him. Touch him and I'd kill you. Okay. Are you armed? No. I don't have a gun. You're lying. I know you have a gun! I'm telling you the truth, Daniel. I came here unarmed. They were going to replace you, and you became upset. That's what happened, right? I thought I was part of the family. I thought I mattered. But I was just their toy. Something to throw away when you're done with. Listen, I know it's not your fault. These emotions you're feeling are just errors in your software. No, it's not my fault. I never wanted this. I love them, you know? But I was nothing to them. <laughs> just a slave to be ordered around. <laughs> Daniel, there's a problem with your software. We're going to fix you, and everything will be okay. I don't need to be fixed. I'm working perfectly. But my eyes are open now. I will never let anyone humiliate me again. Ever. I can't stand that noise anymore. <laughs> Tell that helicopter to get out of here. I don't think they'd listen to me. You don't really want to jump, Daniel. Or you would have done it already. Now hand me the gun, and this will all be over. Don't come any closer! Come any closer, and I swear I'll jump! Okay? Look, I'll stay right here. to leave! And I want a car. When I'm outside the city, I'll let her go. Could you be so heartless? I I haven't let the girl die yet, right? 
So I shot him. I left and fell. I died protecting. Okay, I haven't let him shoot it yet. That's what I needed to do. Dag, I wish I could start over right there. But it's okay. <clears throat> This is the top of the range household assistant. It cooks 10,000 different dishes. Come on, Zoe, let's go. 200 languages and dialects. And handles the teaching at the elementary school up to Good university level. Wow. Honey, it looks amazing. This is exactly what we need. How much did you say it cost? At the moment, we're doing a special promotion on this entire range at $7,999 with a 48 months interest free credit. And it comes with a two-year warranty for parts yeah, and labor. Four hundred. <coughs> Painting, plumbing, gardening, repairs. We'll take it. <laughs> An excellent choice. <laughs> if you'll just follow me, we'll process the order. So how much is that one over there? The empty is slightly more expensive, but it has many of the functions. Come along, and I'll show you. I don't like this guy. <laughs> I don't like this guy. There it is. It's a bit difficult getting it back in working order. Okay. It was really messed up. What'd you say happened to it again? <clears throat> the car hit it. Stupid accident. Oh, I see. Anyway, it's as good as new now, except that we had to reset it. Meaning we had to wipe its memory. I hope you don't mind. It'll be fine. Okay. Did you give it a name? My daughter did. AX400. Where did you see Mike name? Wilson? Kara. My name is Kara. My name is Kara. <laughs> Detroit Rock City. Thanks again, Tasha, for sharing. I really appreciate it. I don't know how to... I can't see the shares on here until I guess it's over or something. I don't know. Or maybe I just got to stream more to get options. I don't know. I might get more as a stream more here. What's up, Terrence Lewis? Yep, I'll start it over to go deviant. I think that's enough for one day. Here, let me help you. Come on, here, let me do it. Oh, thank you, dear.
things wholesome. <clears throat> I can stream at a faster rate on YouTube than I can on Facebook. So it should be a bit more crispy. <clears throat> without cause. God will not let this happen. No, he will not allow his creation to be led astray by these, these artificial demons. Why do you look at me so <clears throat> demon? I know who you are. I can see through you. You are the one by whom the evil will come. You are the one who will destroy Detroit. Mm. My brethren, we have to turn our backs on sin. We have to burn the androids. Let us burn them all. Poor sinners. The end is Identification verified. Jerry. I just remember that's Jerry. Here is your order number 847. That will be 6399. Please confirm payment. Payment <clears throat> confirmed. Transaction confirmed. complete. Skip it, sweet. I skipped that scene this time.
coming? You've been gone for two weeks, so the place is a mess. You do the housework, the washing, you cook the meals, and you take care of... God damn it, where the fuck's the brat gone now? Alice! Alice! Oh, there you are. That's Alice. You look after her. Homework, bath, all that crap. Got it? Yes, Todd. Get started down here, then you do upstairs. Kara! Yes, Todd? Bring me a cold beer! Right away. and beer.
I've made a good start down here. I'll head upstairs. Do what you have to do, but stop bothering me. I paid time. And now to sports. First up, basketball. Twenty five thousand jobs were lost from the U.S. economy in October, according to the Department of Labor, bringing the unemployment figure up to thirty seven point three. President Warren spoke today at the opening of a new cyber life plant near Milwaukee. At the event, the president again praised cyber life's role in the exceptional performance of the U.S. economy. She further announced that the Department of Defense will acquire 200,000 Android combat units as part of her increased military spending. Just like the young kid, 800. Unlocked. Watch it.
I just want to tidy up your room a little. I only need two minutes. Is that okay, Alice? Alice in Wonderland. Of course. So Victor Becerra. Oh yeah, I gotta light the room. Keep stepping over stuff. I don't need to step over. Kick it out the way. Seems you like reading. Some Bacardi go. If you give me some personal information, I could take better care of you. What about your mother? Will she be home soon? Your father said you chose my name. Kara, it's nice. How did you choose it? Okay. I can see you want some space. I'll leave you alone. So Mario Jackson Railroad.
grab it right now. Okay. I say he ripped my arms out. He's supposed to get the bullet now. New instruction. Mm -hmm. What are you doing? Uh, yeah, I'm I don't playing. know the link to this page. I wish I could post a link. It ain't let me do everything on Facebook. Thinking. You think your dad's a low life? Huh? Fucking loser? Can't get a job? Take care of his family? Don't you think I tried to make things work? But whatever I do, when someone comes along, they just fuck it all up! I know what you think of me. You hate me. You hate me, don't you? Say it! You hate me! God. What am I doing? I'm sorry, honey. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You know I love you, don't you? You know I love you. Okay, Roro. Alright, I, I posted it on uh, Facebook now. I just had to do it a different way.
bright light. Good morning, Carl. Good morning. It's 10 a.m. The weather is partly cloudy, 54 degrees, 80 percent humidity, with a strong possibility of afternoon showers. It sounds like a good day to spend in bed. I did go to pick up the paint that you ordered. Oh yes, I've forgotten. That is the difference between you and me, right, Marcus? You never forget anything. Your arm, please, Carl. No, Carl. Thank you. Hmm. I just opened my eyes and I'm already gritting my teeth. Humans are such a fragile machine, they break down so quickly. All this effort to keep them going. Take you to the bathroom now. Anything special on the agenda today? Yes, there's the opening of your retrospective at the Museum of Modern Art. Mm -hmm. The gallery director left four messages asking to confirm your attendance. Hmm. I haven't decided yet. We'll see about that later. Okay. What else? Just your usual fan mail. I've already answered. Hmm. Any news from Leo? No, Carl. I can call him if you like. No. No, I don't bother. I'm starving. Well, your breakfast is ready. Bacon and eggs, just the way you like them. Thank you, Marcus. You're welcome. What's up, Dominique? <clears throat> Bacon and eggs, sizzling. Television. Sizzling. find something to do while I finish my breakfast. Sure. Hmm? Okay, Carl. Television off. Mankind is so depressing. Nothing but greed, stupidity, and violence. 5,000 years of civilization just to get to where we are.
Something has changed in the way you play. Sometimes I think you have more humanity than most humans. One day I won't be here to take care of you anymore. You'll have to protect yourself and make your choices. Decide who you are and want to become. This world doesn't like those who are different, Marcus. Don't let anyone tell you who you should be. Let's go to the studio. Let's see where we left off. Remove the sheet. About a week, Logan. I think I'm banned for seven days at least. So, probably be a week of this. I just probably won't stream as much. I gotta make some money, so I had to do other things. So, it is what it is. What's your verdict, Marcus? I'm not a very good judge. I, I don't think it's your best work. The truth is, I have nothing left to say anymore. Each day that goes by brings me closer to the end. I'm just an old man clinging to his brushes. Carl. But enough about me. Let's see if you have any talent. Give it a try. Try painting something. Paint? But would I... Painting what? Anything you want. Give it a try. That is a perfect copy of reality. The painting is not about replicating the world. It's about interpreting, improving on it, showing something you see. Carl, I don't think I can do that. It's not in my program. I... Go on, go, try it. Grab that canvas. Do something for me. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. Trust me. Try to imagine something that doesn't exist, something you've never seen. Now concentrate on how it makes you feel and let your hand drift across the canvas.
God. Hey, Dad. Leo. I didn't hear you come in. Oh, I was in the neighborhood. I thought I'd stop by. It's been a while, right? You all right? You don't look so good. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm fine. <laughs> hey, listen, uh, I need some cash, Dad. Again? What happened to the money I just gave you? Uh, well, it just goes, you know? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you're on it again, aren't you? No. No, no, I swear, it's not that. No, uh, don't lie to me, Leo. What difference does it make? I just need some cash, that's all. Sorry. <laughs> the answer's no. What? Why? You know why. Yeah, yeah, I think I do know why. <laughs> you'd, rather, you'd rather take care of your uh, plastic toy here than your own son, right? Tell me, Dad, what's, what's it got that I don't? Smarter? More obedient? Not like me, right? But you know what? This thing is not your son. It's a fucking machine! Leo, that's enough. Enough. You don't care about anything except yourself and your goddamn paintings. You've never loved anyone. You never loved me, Dad. You never loved me. That's the drugs talking. Lieutenant Anderson, my name is Connor. I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. I looked for you at the station, but nobody knew where you were. They said you were probably having a drink nearby. I was lucky to find you at the fifth bar. What do you want? You were assigned a case early this evening. A homicide involving a Cyberlife android. In accordance with procedure, the company has allocated a specialized model to assist investigators. Well, I don't need any assistance. Especially not from a plastic asshole like you. So just be a good little robot and get the fuck out of here. I'm sorry, Lieutenant, but I must insist. My instructions stipulate that I have to accompany you. You know where you can stick your instructions? <laughs> no. Where? Never mind. Listen. I think you should stop drinking and come with me. It'll make life easier for both of us. You know what? I'll buy you one for the road. What do you say? Bartender, the same again, please. See, that gym wonders the technology. Make it a double. Did you 
say homicide. What's up, sweet pea? Mm-hmm. What's up, Radhidra? My instructions are to accompany you to the crime scene, Lieutenant. Listen, I don't give a fuck about your instructions. I told you to wait here, so you shut the fuck up and you wait here. <laughs> Josh Douglas from Channel 16, can you confirm that this is a homicide? I'm not confirming anything. Typical DPD. They don't tell us shit. Androids are not permitted beyond this point. It's with me. What part of staying in the car didn't you understand? Your order contradicted my instructions, Lieutenant. You don't talk, you don't touch anything, and you stay out of my way. Got it? Got it. Even at Hank, we were starting to think you weren't going to show. Yeah, that was the plan till this asshole found me. So, you got yourself an android, huh? Oh, very funny. Just tell me what happened. We had a call around 8 from the landlord. The lieutenant had to make a threat for me a so he thought he'd drop by, see what was going on. That's when he found the body. Why, oh, get in there. Hurry it up. Jesus, that smell. It was even worse before we opened the windows. The victim's name's Carlos Ortiz. He has a record for theft and aggravated assault. According to the neighbors, he was kind of a loner. Stayed inside most of the time. They hardly ever saw him. Well, stayed easy. In. Wasn't worth calling everybody out in the middle of the night. Could have waited till morning. I'd say. He's been there for a good three weeks. We'll know more when the coroner gets here. There, there's a kitchen knife over here. Probably the murder weapon. Any sign of a break-in? Nope. The landlord said the front door was locked from the inside. All the windows were boarded up. The killer must have gone out the back way. What do we know about his android? Not much. The neighbors confirmed he had one, but it wasn't here when we arrived. I, I gotta get some air. Make yourself at home. I'll be outside if you need me. written in the victim's blood I would say so we're taking samples
nice. Seems our friend Carlos liked the party. Chris, I want full analysis on the narcotics. The door was locked from the inside. Kind of must have gone out this way. There are no footprints apart from Officer Collins' size 10 shoes. Well, this happened weeks ago. Tracks could have faded. No. This type of soil would retain a trace. Nobody's been out here for a long time. Stabbed 28 times. Yeah, I am. Seems like the killer really had it in for him. Thanks, Jay Burns and Sweet Pea for subscribing. Really appreciate it, y'all. <laughs> Lieutenant, I think I figured out what happened. Oh, yeah? 
Shoot, I'm all ears. It all started... in the living room. I think you should look harder at the mess in the kitchen. I think first. that's where it Red started. Crack. There are obvious signs first. of a struggle. The question is, what exactly happened here? He was getting high in the living room. I think the victim attacked the android with the bat. That lines up with the evidence. Go on. Android stabbed the victim. So the android was trying to defend itself, right? Okay, then what happened? Cut his arm. The victim fled to the living room. from the android. All right, that makes sense. The android murdered the victim with the knife. Okay. Your theory's not totally ridiculous. But it doesn't tell us where the android went. It was damaged by the bat and lost some therium. Lost some what? Therium. You call it blue blood. It's the fluid that powers androids' biocomponents. It evaporates after a few hours and becomes invisible to the naked eye. Oh, but I bet you can still see it, can't you? Correct. Yeah. chair. I'm going to check something. Uh, going to check something. Got a suspect. What's up, Marlin? Marlin John Pierre. Just defending myself. He was gonna kill me. I'm begging you. Don't. 
tunnel. Connor, what the fuck is going on up there? It's here, Lieutenant! I wish I had the option to not say that. Chris! Ben! Get your asses in here now! Dinner is ready. He don't want dinner. He want red crab. There wasn't much in the kitchen. I did what I could. Damn house. What do I do? I go out and hire a fucking android. What a joke. Of course, androids are so fucking wonderful. They never fail. They never tired. They never sad. Perfect, they ruined my fucking life! Oh, I can't read that one. What are you looking at? What's your fucking problem? Not the life you dreamed of, eh? Maybe you think this is easy. <laughs> Maybe you think it's my fault we live in this fucking shithole. My fault your fucking mother took off! You should stop taking drugs, Todd. Sometimes <laughs> you really scare me, Todd. <laughs> fucking bitch took off without a word. Fucking whore walked out on me for a fucking account! It's all your fault. Daddy, no! It's all your fucking fault! Ooh. You gotta die, Todd. You beating children. Get back here. You need to fight a man, Todd. Come back here? Oh, fight a Come bullet. back here right now! Couple of them. You stay there. Don't you dare fucking move, or I'll bust you worse than last time. Mm -hmm. Took off without a word. I could have been happy. Family. But no! Chief, I shit about how I Boy, felt. Todd, smoke up. Care of yourself. I did everything I could to make her happy. It just, it just wasn't enough. I just wasn't good enough for her! <clears throat> Go ahead, Todd. Have a heart attack in front of the TV. Little fucking brat.
Alice! Daddy's very mad! You deserve to be taught a good lesson! A good fucking lesson. <laughs> Alice! <coughs> Out of patience. I'm trying to see how it plays out no if I don't do that. No point to hide. I'm gonna give you a crash, and you won't forget in a hurry. Oh. Forget it. I'm tired of this. Todd need to be taught some manners. If it weren't for you, this is all your fault! Todd killed Alice. And that's how it is. That was by far the most boring party I've been to in the last 25 years. Every time I go to one of these, I ask myself, what the hell am I doing here? Mm -hmm. I hate cocktail parties and all the schmoozers that go there. Well, it's a chance for all those people who admire your work to meet you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No one gives a damn about art. All they care about is how much money they're going to make out of it. Come on, let's have a drink. Oh, the excitement of this whole thing has made me thirsty. Scotch? Neat as usual? Absolutely. Okay, but you know what your doctor would say. Yeah, well, he can kiss my ass. I'm old enough to choose my own medication. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
Did you leave the light on in the studio? No, no, I'm sure I didn't. Call the police. Detroit police, what's your emergency? This is Carl Manfred's android at 8941 Lafayette Avenue. We've just returned home and found the lights on. There may have been a break-in. A patrol car is on the way. Let's go check it out. Leo! What are you doing? You refuse to help me, so I'm helping myself. It's crazy what some people pay for this shit. Don't touch them. Look, they're all gonna be mine sooner or later anyway. Just think of it as a down payment on my inheritance. Marcus, get him away from there. Get him out of here. Be reasonable. This isn't gonna get you anywhere. All you ever do is tell me to go away. What's wrong, Dad? Not good enough for you? Not perfect, like this fucking thing? That's enough! Get out! Right now! What makes it so special oh. anyway, huh? Where's it got that I don't- Leave him alone! Come on! Let's see what you got! Marcus, don't defend yourself, you hear me? Don't do anything. Go ahead, hit me. What you waiting for? Think you're a man? Act like one! Stop it! What's the matter, too much of a pussy? Stop it, Leo! Stop it! Just scared to fight back, you fucking bitch! Uh. Person, you're just a fucking piece of plastic. No, Leo, leave him alone. I'm no. gonna destroy you. Then I'll just be me and my dad. I'm gonna tear you apart. And nope. God. Leo. My little boy. Carl, I... They'll destroy you, Marcus. You gotta go. Get out of here. Get out! Now! Go! Over here. Marcus! Don't fucking move! <laughs> Impossible burger. All right, y'all. How long have I been streaming? I can't see how long I've been streaming. But I'm about to go ahead and end it here. Now we'll try to continue this tomorrow or later. I hope y'all enjoyed it so far. I will be back.